All right, so how's it going, everybody? Welcome to NHL 19. Can't believe I finally get to say that, but here we are with the game. And uh, honestly, I cannot wait in to get into this year. I think this year is going to be fantastic. I am so excited. I have tons of things lined up going forward, basically. And it's all in this here little book. So this little book is going to bring tons of videos, tons of great content here to the channel. And I'm excited for this year. But today, with the help of NHL 19 and the simulation engine in the game, we're going to be putting a question that a lot of people have to the test. That question being, what would happen if today's NHL stars were to play against the absolute best players from the history of the NHL? Now, as you know, EA Sports in NHL 19 has gotten the rights to a lot of NHL alums and legends. Uh, this is going to be made possible from exactly that. So we're going to be taking the best players in today's NHL and putting them up against the best players of yesterday's NHL in today's versus video. So if you guys are new here on the channel, this is your first time here, definitely be sure to leave a like and subscribe because there's going to be tons of 19 videos coming out that you're not going to want to miss. We're going to be covering pretty much everything in this game and doing absolutely everything we can. But let's look at the team right now. Uh, not being today's NHL superstars. So starting things off on the first line for the NHL superstars, we have Alexander Ovechkin, centered by Connor McDavid, and Sidney Crosby on the right wing. Second line, we have Evgeny Malkin, centered by Steven Stamkos, and Nikita Kucherov on his wing. Third line, we have my favorite player, Johnny Hockey, Johnny Gaudreau, centered by Patrice Bergeron and Patrick Kane. And fourth line, we have probably one of the things that Edmonton regrets the most, and that's trading away Taylor Hall, centered by Tyler Sagan and Vladimir Tarasenko. Defensively, they line up with Victor Hedman paired with Drew Doughty, Brent Burns paired with Eric Carlson, and P.K. Subban paired with Alex Petrangelo. In net for today's superstars, we have Carey Price getting the start with Sergei Bobrovsky backing him up. Now here you are, here you have it, the absolute moment you guys have been waiting for to see the all-time legends in NHL 19, and this team is just absolutely insane. I think this game is going to be absolutely crazy between the two teams. So let's stop wasting time, let's get into it, let's see who is going up against who. So on the first line for the all-time legends, we have Joe Sackick, centered by the great one himself, and Luke Robitaille, Gretzky. Sakic, Robitaille, that line is insane. Second line, we have Brian Taudier, Mario Lemieux, and Guy Lafleur. Third line is Dale Howarchuk, Mark Messier, and the Finnish phenom Timu Solani. Fourth line is Marcel Dion, Jean Beliveau, and Brett Hall. So just crazy names, huge guys, and we are going to be putting them up against today's NHL superstars and see how they fare. I think this game could go either way. Let's look at the defense now. Defensively is Larry Robinson, partnered with Al McInnes, Phil Housey, partnered with Paul Coffey, and the man who just wouldn't retire, Chris Pronger, and Dennis Potvin. In net for the all-time NHL legends is none other than Patrick Waugh, and backing him up is Jacques Plante. So here you have the two teams, 100 offense, 100 defense, with uh, Patrick Watt giving the nod to the Legends. I figured that they would get the home ice advantage, and we're going to be throwing things back with the white jerseys being home, black jerseys being away. Because um, when the Legends played, let's be real, those were the home jerseys. And just look at those jerseys. They just look absolutely phenomenal. Um, gold on them and everything. Gretzky looks great. Uh, let me know down in the comment section who you think is going to take this one. Is it going to be the Legends or is it going to be today's Superstars? I think it's going to be the Legends. I don't think that we're even going to see a comparable. Like, their hockey skill was just incredible. Um, but hey, it could go either way. So let's go ahead and jump right into this game. So here we are at the EA Sports Arena in Burnaby, BC, where we're going to have an absolute matchup of a lifetime, a matchup of a century. These guys never got to play against each other. Um in their actual NHL careers, uh, and we're going to see exactly today who's going to take that. So Patrick Waugh going up against Carey Price, Montreal legends in net, and just overall Hall of Famers, everything else on the ice. McDavid against Gretzky, if ever think you would see this right there, and here we have it right here, and it is actually going to be Gretzky taking that one, walking it in, taking a shot, low shot on Patrick Waugh, and that one's going to be turned away. Luke Robitaille flipping it out. Crosby's going to keep that one in the zone. McDavid in the middle, and that's off the post. Connor McDavid with the first looks, potentially the next Gretzky, 
and here it is, the great one carrying it in right now. He gets hooked up a little bit there, and there's going to be a power play. Gretzky draws the hook, and here we have the official results. So it is actually Connor McDavid, of all people, hooking the great one, Wayne Gretzky. You can't make this stuff up. And that's going to be a power play for the legends. Mario Lemieux. So Mario Lemieux now. Super Mario. That shot goes wide, but an absolute rocket there. And he's going to get his own rebound. The superstars need to contain him better if they're going to be winning this game. Looking to make some space with it. He had the chance, but he loses the puck. Now he's down low, flipping that one to McDavid. Kane in front, but Patrick Waugh gets there to make a big save. Huge hit there. McDavid absolutely levels a guy. One-timer, but again, Patrick Waugh is standing on his head right now. You can hear the crowd just going absolutely nuts, which is a huge feature in NHL 19 that I love. It gets loud. And here it is again, just Patrick Waugh doing what Patrick Waugh does best, and that's keeping pucks out of the net. Flipping it up to Patrick Kane now, back to Petrangelo, back to Kane, into the middle, and they miss the one-timer. Sidney Crosby can't bury it. Nikita Kucherov with the puck, and he's coming up the wing fast. Moving into the slots, making some space. Doughty isn't all alone, and Patrick Waugh puts the pad down and stops that one from crossing the goal crease. Crosby taking that one away, today's great one, and once again, Alexander Ovechkin coming in with the puck, making some nice moves with it, he's got space, and that one's off the post, Crosby is missing as well as McDavid, both have had chances, there's a hit and he loses control of the puck, and Lafure's in the corners, gets knocked off there, as two guys on him, Malkin is going to come away, drop his stick there, we're going to be having a penalty on the Legends for hooking, you can't do that in today's NHL. Um, something that they probably did a lot when they were younger. Let's get a better look at this one. And uh, yeah, so you see right there, just hook. Malkin drops his stick, and you're going to the box, Lafure. Kane gets knocked off the puck there in the corner. Can't exactly see what's going on. There's a big battle going on. Paul Coffey throwing that one around the boards. Petrangelo picks it up into the center, and Patrick Kane is going to get the first goal of the game on what a play. What a play. Puck gets dumps around the boards. They're picked up. Moved nicely, and I believe Sidney Crosby fed him the puck, and it was an absolute beautiful feed. Patrick Kane getting the first goal in this here game, and you knew it was going to come eventually. You knew it was going to happen eventually. So let's get another look. So there it is. Crosby picks it up. A no-looker. Kane backing up, takes the shot, and is going to beat Patrick Waugh. No-look pass. Beautiful pass. Knocks the bottle off. Nothing you can do about that. That's just good haul. So Hall with it now gets knocked down. And Victor Hedman, the delayed penalty already. And we are going to be having the uh, Legends going back on the uh, penalty kill. Mark Messier. Can't be doing whatever you just did. Would look to be tripping. Up against the boards there. Patrick Kane throwing it back to the point. Carlson into the middle. One-timer. Save for Patrick Waugh once again. The guy is lights out. Joe Sackett going to throw that one across. Gretzky picks it up, and they're starting to move the puck well. They're starting to feel it. Sackett with a low shot save there by Carey Price. Penalty kill for the Legends. Crosby in with it now. He has some space throwing this one to Petrangelo now. He's trying to make some space. Nice little move there. One-timer. Glove save by Patrick Waugh, taking Patrick Kane away from his second goal of the night. Kucherov with it now. Back to the point. Drew Doughty shot with nobody on him. It's loose. And Doughty with another shot, and again, a blocker save there by Patrick Waugh. Uh, Mark Messier, but he can't get a hold of that one. And the Superstars are going to take that one away at center ice. They have it now in the attacking zone. Taylor Hall, one-timer, and a big glove save by Patrick Waugh once again on the one-timer. Keep this one-on-one -on -one goal lead for his team. Uh, so Crosby coming in with it now. He's got space in the corner, flowing it back to the point. Crosby to Burns, trying to make something move, trying to get people caught out of position. Down low to Kane, one-timer. Connor McDavid is going to Absolutely bury that one in the back of the net. No problem about that. What a nice play there by the superstars to give them a two-goal lead. McJesus does indeed score in this game. Here it is once again. Just fantastic movement. David just comes in. No one's on him. One-timer. Absolutely no problem. Going to put that one in the back of the net. Nine times out of ten. I would even give it 9.9 .9 times out of ten. That's in the back of the net. McDavid once again in. Blocker save by Patrick Waugh. He's with the puck. Across to McDavid, another one-timer. The goalie is gone. Waugh has gone to the bench. There's an extra attacker. Gretzky could have done it, but he cannot bury it there. McDavid on Gretzky, and we are potentially going to see right here from Sidney Crosby. Misses the net. McInnes, they still have time with the extra man. Wayne Gretzky, the great one, skating in now. He's going to loop on back. 
come back around with it, tries to get it out, but he can't. Tie it up in front of the net. Luke Robitaille with it, losing control of it. Eric Carlson now has it for the last 30 seconds. So Sidney Crosby throwing to McDavid, throwing Ovechkin. Ovechkin shot, also misses the net from center ice. They still have time. Paul Coffey there. Joe Sackick with the puck now. Are they going to get it before the buzzer? Gretzky tries to take it in the zone. He's going to get in. He still has the puck. Robitaille looking for the pass. Can't get it off. 14 seconds down to the last 10. Robitaille now has it down low. Patrick Kane taking that one away. Losing control of it. Goudreau with it. Coffee with it. And that's going to be our game. Tripped up there with 3.2 seconds left. So 3.2 seconds left. Unless they score off this draw here, this game will be a shutout from the Legends, and it does not look like they are going to be doing that. So, this game went completely how I did not think it was going to go. I thought it was going to be a high-scoring game, didn't realize it was going to be 2 nothing, and the Legends were going to get shut out. I figured that each team would both be getting at least one goal. That's not what happened at all. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know if you guys predicted the correct winner of this game and let me know if, what you guys want to see in the future for these kind of videos we can do anything so let me know hopefully you enjoyed thank you for watching and i will talk to you guys next time so i just want to put this out here before i go just really quickly um get a look at the three stars this game patrick wall obviously undoubtedly the first star of the game had 30 saves on 32 shots that's just incredible there was 30 shots 32 shots sorry to 10 how on earth would the legends expect to even come close to winning a game where they get 10 shots on carry price it's just not gonna happen not gonna happen at all as well as 12 power play minutes it's not the hockey that they're used to anymore so once again thank you for watching hopefully you enjoyed i'll talk to you guys next time